Um, I'm introducing Brenda Hillman, and I just wanted to say a few what her, yeah, she's already known her resume, it speaks for itself, but um, we, we were asked to consider, you know, what we thought about the, the poem in the Best American Poetry Anthology that happened to be selected, and um, this was a this was a funny one for me. It really made me kind of stop and think. I, I as a as a writer, tend to shy away very um, seriously from writing poetry that is political, that is in response to things like environmental disasters or you know, industrial disasters, things like this. I, I'm, I'm afraid of that kind of material, I think, because it's so easy to be either ham-handed or didactic or polemical or, you know, dewy-eyed, sincere to the point of making people want to barf or, you know, whatever. It's, but, and, and so when I read this poem, I just was, it's in response to the BP uh, deep water you know, well disaster, and it is astonishing to me that the skill set that it takes to write about this kind of heavily socially laden subject matter in a way that is um, that is delicate without pulling punches, that is deft um, and careful, and it doesn't. What I love about this poem, actually, is that it's not a poem that makes you think. It's a poem that lets you think. And I, I think that is a, a, a thing of beauty and takes an extraordinarily delicate set of skills. So it is my great pleasure to introduce Brenda Holman. Thank you very much.